Another nightmare. Oh, yet another nightmare. She entered my dreams once more. Maybe she wants to talk to me. What am I saying? Fairy tales coming true. What's going on down <laughs> there? No, no, these are the thoughts of a crazy person, and I'm not crazy. Jeez. Oh, damn it, what's all this blood? I'm not due yet, and there's a lot more than usual. What's happening to me? Am I going to be joining Martha sooner than I thought? I have to wash up and do what needs to be done. Oh, what? I'm sick, I have little time. We're the pregnant. Waits me. It must be hidden within those rolls. There we go. All right. The photo is upside down. What does that mean? All right, well, where are some Martha's clothing today? We'll go with the, the white top. What am I thinking? I would stain my clothes with blood. We need to wash up first. What am I thinking? I would stain my clothes with blood. We need to get to the, the washroom, I guess. Right here. I think that would have been an important information That's to better. know <laughs> that but we were pregnant. I still don't understand all of that blood. That's never happened to me before. But I'm not going to tell my doctor. Otherwise, he'll make me stay in bed and rest. All right, now we got to get changed. Or change the sheets. Magician completed. I kind of wish that they would tell us what we got the achievement for. All right, let's go develop those photos. Grab my bag. We need to like brush our teeth. It's very rude, but. I could pick up the phone and listen to their conversation. Sure. How are you doing today, Rennie? I'm worried, Father. Very worried. We found more partisan tracks in the woods, right next to the house. That Lapo. I suspect he may be involved in the death of... No, please don't say that. It's, it's not possible. I know the boy and I don't... Father, anything is possible in these dark times. Anything. That boy didn't even come to say goodbye to Julia. Didn't they love each other dearly? He must be terribly scared, and Julia always used to say that. Yeah, sure, she used to say they were just friends, but you know too, right? Friends are not supposed to do such things, Father. Or are they? But anyway, you're defending them both. You, my husband, and even the nanny, who, deep down, is a good woman. The nanny? I believe the nanny is the one who hurt Julia. With an evil passion for those cards. They are cursed things. I hope you made them disappear. Of course. I keep them safe in my room. Anyway, you must forgive me, Father. I have to go. They've come to pick me up. Have a good day. You too. Lapo's involved oh, in Martha's death. My mother is losing her mind again. How could anyone even imagine such nonsense? And Don I was Tenio, thinking that too. He is a great friend, but what a weird view. Those cards are just a game. Most importantly, the they're mine. Why on earth did they take them from me? Well, what? What are they talking about? Alright, we'll go look for those cards. Dear Mother, this is hard, but I have something to tell you. I found out that Julia is pregnant. Go to the lake tomorrow morning at 7 and watch her as she bathes. 
you'll see that her tummy is growing. Oh, what? What? I'm not pregnant. Why is everything becoming even more confusing? What? I thought we were... She... I'm searching for an explanation, but instead I'm left with more questions. Oh, okay. <laughs> She's... Okay, I get... I, I misunderstood that when she, first, when she first said that she was due. I thought she meant like she was due for... Romola, 15th birth. of July, 1944. Dear Mrs. Irene, I'm writing to let you know that all is well here at the villa. Thank you for being so considerate and caring. I apologize for the simplicity of the housing you were forced to live in. I also locked the room where the little one used to stay as requested. I've left you the key. It is the one with the pink key ring. Try to stay safe. Best regards, Nanny. Pink key ring. Why on earth did Mummy have that door locked? It was my room. What is she trying to hide? Do you think it could be the mother that killed Martha? Possibly. The tarot cards, here we go. Here are my cards. Nanny and I always used to play with them. She would predict my future and I pretended to predict hers. The future was always good for everyone. Maybe when she read them, she saw my true future which she hid from me. Or more likely, these cards are actually just a stupid game to reassure and deceive oneself with. But deceiving oneself is sometimes necessary. How can we live happily otherwise? Perverton again. I feel like these pills do nothing other than agitate her. The rifle. There are more and more weapons around, and everyone is scared after what happened. This is Mummy's jewellery. She wears them every day. Even though Daddy says it's impractical and dangerous to show signs of wealth these days. As usual, she doesn't want to listen to reason and ends up arguing with Daddy until he goes to play war, as she says. Right, we need to find the key to Julia's room, too, at some point. Develop the photo, develop the roles. Things the two have found this note. Things. It's Martha's handwriting, but it doesn't make any sense. Alright, we read that. Why they have... Why have they locked my childhood room? In the letter, Nanny does not say where she left the keys. They had a pink key ring attached to them. The superior commander of the German Federal Armed Forces announces 1. Whoever is in possession of weapons or explosives not reported to the German headquarters will be shot. 2. Whoever harbors bandits and or protects them and provides them with clothing and or weapons will be shot. 3. Whoever is aware of the existence of any rebel groups or even lone rebels without reporting them will be shot. Jeez. War rages on the Eastern Front, an attack launched by the Soviets after hours of cannonade. The fight on this front has been going on for a long time. Fighting in Normandy, victorious Germanic counterattack on the road from Perriers to Carentan. Pont Heber reconquered north of Saint Lo. Many U.S. losses caused by the flying bomb action. Italian workers in Germany. The following rules are in place for workers who voluntarily work in Germany. A commitment of a maximum period of one year before returning to Italy. Alright, let's go develop the film. What are these? Is that like a recording? Tape recorder. What is that? Orange filter. When there is fog, it improves the image by giving it some contrast. With this lens, I can shoot very close up. There we go. 
These, these are attachments for Red our camera. Red filter for super high contrast photos. Blue filter, ideal for indoor photos. This lens increases the framed area. It allows me to fit more into the image. With this lens, everything gets bigger. A lens and a roll of infrared film. They can photograph what the naked eye cannot see. Infrared. Wow, that's pretty high tech. The hanged man completed. I have to be careful and keep the volume down as I listen. I must go unnoticed. I am meant to be deaf after all. Ready? Julia? You ready? Sure, Daddy. I'm good to start. I've already started recording. Oh, no, my voice will sound awful. No way, come on. Didn't you want to study singing anyway? No, 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 I was young and stupid when I said that. Okay, ready. Go. Oh, how nice. It's the rehearsal for last week's concert. I never heard the recording. But oh. I was right, my voice is awful. It cannot be called singing. Anyway, it's time I develop these film roles. I can't wait any longer. I wish I could just stop time. Apparently it's copyrighted. <laughs> That's why it's uh, the music is disabled for streamer mode. I apologize. I bet it's a, a nice, nice song. Probably won't even have ads on this video. I don't know why I turned that on. Wait, let's turn it on right now. See what happens. I just don't want the video to get blocked. That's the only thing I'm worried about. There we go. Might as well listen to that while we develop the photo. Everything. I cannot bear the fact that I may have hurt Martha. I would rather die. Damn my head and these memory lapses. It's such a pain not remembering. It's like getting lost inside yourself. Wait, she's not singing. She's just like playing the flute. that you gotta wait 10 seconds for this uh, I don't think there's anything important in this one I guess we could scrap it. I'll, I'll just put them all in the photo album. Screw it. Right, you can skip all, a lot of this. <laughs> Oh, what the hell is that? Did you see that? Right there. Can hear jets flying by. That'd be terrifying, actually. There she is. I'm carrying Martha to shore. I'm trying to save her. My memories, although fuzzy, do match reality. I feel a little better. Now I can find out who really hurt Martha. Maybe I should meet with the white lady. She might be able to tell me something. Is this crazy talk? Yes, definitely. But what's normal about any of this? Maybe you have to be a little crazy to get anything done. 
There we go, we found the photo. Can we develop the other ones? I think that's all we needed. To progress the story. Go to the lake. Find the keys, strange notes. Develop the photo. Yeah, here we go, we got... I'll develop the photo of Martha. Right here. A photograph is both the present and the past, like a dead body. I don't know what I'm expecting. Maybe it's silly to think you can capture the soul of someone who has died. Her face can't tell me anything anymore. I know that, really. Her lack of expression scares me. I don't even know whether to keep this blank photo with me or just throw it away. We'll keep it. Even though I'd rather have a f photo of a person alive than, than dead. All right, now we gotta go to the lake. What happened to the music? It's nice having that in the background. Oh, oh I thought that was blood. I just spilled wine. We still gotta find the bike pump. Hey, there's a stand here. A tripod is necessary to take photos with long exposures. I'll take that. I have found what I need to take in for red photos. There we go. Infrared. I'll try this. You need a really long exposure, I guess. All right, so we need the blue filter, and then wait, well, no, we need the infrared film and the tripod. Wait, there we go. I think we have it selected already. In focus and too dark. There we go. Oh, the frame rate just tanked. What what is going on? What is going on? What the hell is this? Why? All right, I need to get out of this area. You got like 10 frames a second. That's much better. Here we go. We'll read it once it's done. I don't want to miss the the green. He who flees from the what light hides joke? behind it. Maybe someone wrote on the film? Also, what does that even mean? Light, like divine light? Something to do with religion, maybe? I like that quote, actually. Pretty cool. leave 
this as the centre of our farm, but since we moved here, it hasn't worked like it used to. Security matters, Daddy says. All right, we need to get to the lake. We'll go do that. I wonder if we can take the bike down but to the lake. So it's, it said it's like the fast travel in this game. We went right last time. Maybe we'll go left. Actually, I want to go take a photo of the, the military helmet. I may have missed it. We'll see. Oh, it's right here. So bright. How do we get closer? Oh, there. Exposure. It's properly exposed. There's the focus. Yeah, I wish Can I could zoom in. Daddy ordered patrols to be carried out near the house, but how could they have lost a helmet? God only knows. Oh shit! The hell? Those rebel soldiers? doing it's dangerous i know but i want to follow them and see what's happening Verdammt. the gunfight in the woods oh! you're gonna get shot Martina. oh you walked over a mine Talk to him. Oh God, please no. Lapo, my dear friend. Oh no, that's our friend. What have they done to you? Your handkerchief was the symbol of what you believed in. At least that is left of you. There's a note. Dear Julia, are you surprised that I've addressed this to you and don't think you're dead? Everyone calls you Martha now, right? I know you too well. I can never understand why no one else can ever tell you apart. Not even your own mother and father. Martha is gone and I cannot reconcile myself. <laughs> Oh shit. Du hast ein Mädchen erschossen, du Idiot. Scheiße, scheiße, scheiße. Was machen wir jetzt? Sieh mal, was sie um ihren Hals hat. Sie ist eine von ihnen. Es musste getan werden. Sie ist die Tochter von General Erich K., du verdammter Trottel. Sie war die Freundin von diesem armen Kerl. Oh, verdammt, jetzt sind wir wirklich am Arsch. Scheiße, lass uns abhauen. Aber, aber sie lebt noch. Sie liegt im Sterben. Siehst du, wo du sie getroffen hast? Sie ist bestimmt schon tot. Wir müssen jetzt abhauen, sonst sind wir auch bald tot. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. I'm no. dying, I thought. But strangely enough, I wasn't afraid. 
In fact, I was almost relieved. When I returned, I found myself once again in the midst of a bad dream. One whose meaning I did not understand at the time. Martha? Come out. Martha. I give you back. Your appearance. I give you I give you Oh shit. I give you back. Alright, so Martha. Jeez. Martha w must have been shot then by a soldier for being this dude's girlfriend. That's probably what happened. I give you back your appearance. Now, now I see through. Now I see with my eyes. Is that the white lady? sisters were destined to die. Julia, the first sister, and Martha, the second. On Julia's day of departing, identical twins stood before me, impossible to tell apart. They questioned my presence, since they were still so young. Julia must come with me, I demanded. But they both claimed to be Martha. I explained that Martha's fate was soon to be the same, and their games were useless. I didn't have time for it. The war was keeping me busy. But they didn't concede, and instead kept insisting. Can we follow you together? No. Impossible. Are you sure Martha will die too? Nothing is certain in wartime. What if the wrong person went with you? Then you would have cheated death. One would die unjustly, and the other would simply be delaying her fate. They discussed amongst themselves, then hugged before one of them came forward. She stared in a determined, almost threatening manner. I guessed it was Martha sacrificing herself giving more time to her sister. But I stayed silent, not to reveal their failed deception. No one lies to the face of their own death. So I asked how their choice was reached. We do lots by throwing a medallion, she said quietly. They had trusted in fate. Oh, how naive they were. They knew fate plays by its own rules, which is true, but it is also my ally. 
Fate never would have allowed the wrong girl to follow me. In that case, my work was done. She must have been Julia. However, little to my knowledge at the time, that blasted medallion had the same name engraved on both sides. Martha's. So, my first assumption was correct. They were too damn smart, and had fooled both fate and me. One thing is for sure. I'll put things back where they belong. I will correct my ignorance and give fate back its blindfold. They outsmarted death. <laughs>